everyone and welcome back to my channel. So. The nail salon that I did my nails closed down because of COVID. So I obviously can't go right now. Even when they do open, I don't know if I feel safe going back for a while. So instead of just going to another nail salon, I decided to try doing my nails at home. And I wanted to try out this new thing that's called poly gel. Some of you guys have probably heard of it. Some of you guys have probably tried it. I bought this poly gel nail kit online. It's essentially kind of like a middle ground between acrylics and gel. This sort of paste that you buy that you put on your nails and you squish it down and it becomes like a nail essentially you guys will get it but I wanted to try it out because if this turns out as good as I expect then I can hold off on going to the nail salon for a couple months if I keep just retouching my poly gel because this apparently lasts for like a couple weeks much longer than my gel nails a couple weeks ago I did red gel nails and as you can see I don't have them on anymore so they just chipped off and I have a million to do my nails again so let's try it out together why not one buff the nail two put base coat then get the little plastic thingy I don't know if you guys can see but it comes with these little plastic fake nails kind of things. you don't keep them on your nail you just use them to flatten the paste that they give you and then you put it under a gel light it essentially hardens the paste and then you pop these off and then you have a fake nail so my sister tried it already and she said to try not to get anything on your cuticle because then that's leverage for the nail to start peeling off so another tip that she said is that if you want your nails to be super long she suggests to do it two coats but I don't want really long nails I just want like medium-ish length nails that are a little bit longer than I have right now but comfortable enough to do things so let's see how this goes why are there two clear why is it clear and pink well pink has a pinkish color wait yeah. show the people how, how how you finish doing it we'll show you <laughs> wow you're a guru now Hi! It's Happy holidays! It's November. It's before Thanksgiving. You can't say Merry Christmas before Thanksgiving. No, okay. That is my pet peeve. No it's still fall! Okay, this is how it goes. It's November 1st, mm -hmm. 12 a.m. Mm -hmm. You celebrate Christmas, right? Then on Thanksgiving, you celebrate Thanksgiving. And you go back to Christmas no, or you your respective holiday. Christmas. It goes in order. You have Halloween, then right. you have a whole month of still fall time. That is before Thanksgiving. And then no. on Black Friday is the official first day of Christmas. Don't you guys agree? It's not, it's November. It's like early November. Comment in the comments below if you think she's a Grinch. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so back to what I was saying. You put a little bit of the gel on the little plastic thingy and then you squish it down on your nail, smooth it out on the back of your nail, and then you put it in the gel light, you take it off and you file it, and then you put the top coat. Wouldn't it just go everywhere? I'm gonna try doing the clear one just so that I can see it a little bit easier. I don't know. Should I do the pink so that when I take, no. Nope, nope, I've decided. <laughs> I guess you have to measure what looks good. I'm gonna measure which ones look good for my nails. Okay, I found the right size for my thumb and then I have to find all of the right sizes for the rest of my fingers. So, I'll be right back. All right, I got it all figured out and now it's time to buff the nails. So, I always suck at buffing my nails because I feel like I either do it too much or I do it too little. When do you know you've buffed it enough? Okay, so my nails are buffed and I think I'm gonna start with my right hand solely because I always like to do my nails Nails on my right hand first because I know then it's gonna be easier to do it on my left hand. You guys do that a lot. If you start on your left hand, then you don't have as many high standards than if you start on your right hand. So I can always make this look slightly worse if this comes out pretty bad. So I'm scared. Now I have to apply the base coat. I absolutely suck at remembering to apply base. I always forget. Why do I have a feeling that I'm gonna start doing this and then I'm gonna give up halfway? I'm supposed to leave it in the gel lamp for 60 seconds. Are all of you guys excited that this year is almost ending? Cause I am. I feel like this year has been the longest yet the shortest year of my life. Okay, so I brought a light in so I can see a little bit better. I'm done with the base coat. I don't know if you guys can see. Let me see if I can record this <clears throat> with one hand. I'm supposed to dip this little brush inside of this liquid right here. So my sister gave me this clip because she told me that putting on a clip makes it better. 
One, two, three. <gasps> wow! Now we're supposed to. Oh my god, no! Why? No way, you're lying. I'm supposed to get a nail clipper and get this out. <laughs> I think I'm gonna add more of the gel and like make it longer. I think I can do that. I'm not sure. Might have fixed it. Oh my god. I think it worked. I think it worked. Okay, I think it's working. Also, I started on my left hand and I completely forgot that I wanted to start on my right. How did I forget that? I literally just mentioned that. It looks so good. What? So I have done my two thumbs and the rest of my nails because this video is going to be boring if you just see me do all of my nails. So I'll be back probably an hour from now when I finish all of my nails. And then I'm going to do a little bit of gel color on them. If I have time, we'll see. And then I'll give my final reviews on it. It seems to be working. I'm just scared. If I don't cure it long enough, it'll just snap a lot easier. So I'm trying to see if I can fix that. I'll see you guys in an hour. Okay, it is like two hours later and I am finally done. It took me a lot longer than I expected. So now I'm gonna do a little base coat on top of them. And then I'm gonna put a gel nail color. This is kind of like a dark purple color. I just wanted to keep it in the fall mood, so... Hello everyone, so it is the next morning and I kind of wanted to give a little update on how my nails ended up looking like. It was really late when I finished, so I didn't end up recording how my nails ended up looking like. So I did kind of like this purpley-ish color. It's really shiny and plasticky. It's really good. I'm a perfectionist with things that I enjoy to do like baking and editing and doing anything arty or crafty like my nails or like an art project. I'm like a perfectionist when it comes to those things. So it did take me a lot longer than I expected. I feel like it just takes a lot of practice to get used to them. It ended up taking me three hours to finish everything. I just don't know if it's worth three hours. I don't know how long this is gonna last. In my next video, if I remember, I'll update you guys and see how long these last because the thing is poly gel nails come off with 100% acetone just like gel does you can't take off the gel without taking off the poly gel so if you want to keep putting on different colored gel you're gonna have to layer the gel on top so I don't know how long this is gonna last me and when I want to change the color if I ever do this is supposed to last like six weeks so like a month and a half or so so we'll see I might end up changing the color in a few weeks um, until I get bored of this eventually this is gonna have to grow out so I'm gonna have to go back with a poly gel and a couple weeks and kind of retouch it and refill my nails. Yeah, this is the final review. A little time consuming, but I feel like you just need a lot of practice. It might just be worth it depending on how long it lasts. So, so yeah, that is the final review. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like this video because it helps you let me know. Subscribe for more videos like these and hit the bell notification so you get notified every single time I post. I post every single Sunday and I will see you guys on my next one. Bye.